last time on Dragon Ball Z. Gotta get warmed up, and it's our first official nine man mini game. Super excited. We just finished our first game. A little rough, but that's as expected. This is our first time playing with this group, and CIA has the same group every year, and they're always really solid. So to me, still feel like it was a success because we improved from first set to second set. First set, we lost 13. Second set, we lost 17, and we had to come back. And there's that one swing where it was that I was I just know I could have put it away. I should have like changed direction or something, but I was just trying to bounce it, and they dug me. They did a good job. Really good defensive team. So hopefully we can continue to uh, improve over the tournament. What's really tough is that every point counts, so we have to finish top two in our pool, I think, to guarantee gold tomorrow. Let's see if we can pull it out. We do have one member on the team who has never played nine man, but is built for the game. He plays nine man already indoors because he's all over the place getting some crazy digs. This is Kyle Zolkin. You guys recognize him from Cal practice. Uh, what was your first experience playing nine man? Well, it's a lot of moving parts, and I think like staying disciplined is like the biggest thing that I have to do. Cause I like moving a lot, I like reading, but I'm playing middle back. I have to stay set and like play off the block. Also, a couple points where I just have to like know when to set instead of dig because the block counts as a touch, so it's so hard to get. But we're getting there. It's, it's a fun time. It's crazy out here. It's a lot of people at uh, one place. But yeah. You already got two aces. <laughs> I knew your serve was going to be good. When you have a lot of space to work with, it's yeah. like more deadly. Yeah. It's a lot easier. Yeah. yeah. Good job, Kyle. Best part about not playing is being able to watch all the other teams. Finally got our first win in New York at the Mini. It's so hot. I'm like dripping sweat. There's sweat behind my back. And we're about to rest right now, and then we play right after. Our next game is going to be tough. We're playing against one of the best teams in Nine Man, Con X A. So our chemistry definitely got better in the second set, uh, match. So this is our time to lock it in. the Connex match. Man, we almost had him that first set. Felt like we were gonna do it. And the second set, we just gassed out. I think a lot of our guys are just really struggling in the heat. We actually, and our service heat broke down at the end. That doesn't help. Uh, but it is freaking hot, man. I'm like dripping sweat. I've also drank maybe five Gatorade, so I feel pretty hydrated. Now it's lunch time. 
them. I am burning so many calories and I'm so hungry that I'm eating other people's leftovers. So Brant didn't eat any of his vegetables, so I'm just putting more rice on it. I don't know if you can see the how glossy my arm and shoulder are from the sweat. Man. Squeezed that one barely out, and I was not swinging well. I was like hitting right into the block. Just gotta swing higher, especially as I get more tired. Now we're gonna get some boba because it's so hot and it's my favorite drink. Gotta take off the go sleeves to let them cool off. Gonna take off these shoes to let my feet cool off. Put on the Nikes again. Walking down to get some boba. The weather is so nice in New York. So everyone's been getting this watermelon smoothie and. It looks really refreshing. Let's see how it is. Oh, that is so refreshing. It's so hot here. How's it, guys? It's not that hot. It's not that hot. Man. From, you're from New York. That is some big boba. So I had trouble figuring out what to order because we're going to be playing in about an hour and a half to two hours. So I don't want to eat something too heavy, even though I would love all this Hong Kong style food. So we got some siu mai here. Not bad. That was a good meal. Gotta make sure I drink some Gatorade because I feel my body starting to tighten up. It's so hot right now, still. Got a nice little break going. Pool play is officially over, so we gotta wait for the results. And gotta keep hydrating. One of the things I've been doing a lot this year, playing volleyball, is drinking fruit smoothies in between games. It just makes you feel so refreshed. A lot of sugar, like good sugar. Uh, simple sugars, which you need when you're playing in between games. And then, of course, all the vitamins and minerals. And you just, I just love fruit. It just makes you feel fresh. I'm gonna down this as we get ready for our next game. Everyone's taking a little break. We're just waiting to find out the reseeding. We went four and four today. So we got like a 50% chance that we'll still make gold. I'm so tired right now. I think the, the lack of sleep is finally hitting me, so I might try to close my eyes and take like a five minute nap.